Silver Ridge Peaks. One of the most- Alright, alright, alright. You already know what happens here. I don't need to repeat this. Jeez. That video was literally two months ago. Anyways, what's up guys? It's Tyron here, and today I'm back with another Call of the Wild video. And I did not expect to make another Great One video so soon. So as you guys already know, it's been about two months since I got my first Black Bear Great One. And I said I was going to be taking a nice break from the grind. However, I decided to go on Silver Ridge Peaks again and try to get another Black Bear Great One before Sunder Baton comes out. Because, for those who don't know, the Black Bears are going to be getting a pop reset on all maps they're on. Alongside the Brown Bears and the Grizzly Bears. Now, of course, a few days ago, I did get another Great One Moose. I did say I was going to get another Great One before the new map comes out, or at least try to. But, of course, I decided to go to the Bears, and I decided to kill a couple, see if I can get another one to spawn. And to my surprise, another one actually spawned a lot quicker than the last one. And as you can tell by the fur type, I'm not sure if you could see it, but if you look closely at the head, that is actually a Fable Chestnut. Eventually, we will be getting a better look at the Fable Chestnut Bear once it's down on the ground. And I'm actually really happy because this is my favorite fur type for the Black Bears along with the Cream and Spotted. I'm very happy to have spawned this guy before the reset because once those bears get reset, I will have to remanage my zones and all that. So for this guy, I decided to use the original cap lock muzzle loader from the Smoking Barrels pack. So I decided to take a practice shot on the level 7 here because it doesn't hurt to always warm up with a weapon you haven't used in a while. And I haven't used the hap lock muzzle loader in a long time. So I decided to take a practice shot on this level 7 to warm up before I took out the great one. So after taking out that level 7, I saw the distance between me and the great one and I was like, you know, this is actually not a bad position to take the shot from. But unfortunately... Either there's an accuracy bug with the muzzleloader or a rock just blocked my shot from hitting this guy. However, instead of exiting to the main menu, I decided to follow this guy and wait for him to go nervous or alert so I can get a good shot on him. I was not going to give up just because I missed a shot like that. I decided not to rush the shot on this guy. I decided to just take my time and wait for him to stop before I shot him in the vitals. I ended up picking up a fleeing call from the mountain lion and I hoped that would make the bear go alert so I could get a good shot on him. And luckily, that's what happened. That was a risky shot, but we did get him down on the ground. Anyway, here is an up close look at the Fable Chestnut. I'm happy to have gotten this guy considering the Fable Chestnut is my favorite fur type for the Black Bear Great Ones. And on top of that, we got another Black Bear Great One before Sundar Baton comes out and resets the population. So I decided to get a screenshot for my thumbnail, and I decided to turn off the HUD and the reticle so I could get a good screenshot. Now to pick this big boy up. It's always just a great feeling when you hear that triumphant music when you pick up a great one. You cannot deny that. But yep, finally got a second black bear great one. And my favorite fur type. You a chunky bear, aren't you there, bud? Alright, time to get this guy into the lodge. 
Anyways, I'm sure you already know the drill. We gotta put this guy with the other black bear great one. This is such a really cool mount. I'm happy to have gotten another Black Bear Great one before Sunder Patan comes out. Eventually, I will get back to the Black Bear grind so I can get the other four fur types I'm missing. That being Cream, Spotted, Spirit, and the other variant for Glacier. But that might not be for a while because I'm going to be spending some time on Sunder Patan when it comes out and getting all the new species. You guys probably noticed I wasn't being too loud in this video. And that's because at the time I'm editing this, it is 8.18 a.m. I just wanted to keep it down for anyone in the house that was sleeping, that's all. And on that note, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Check out the Discord server. Thank you guys for watching. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Survive.